Hi, it's Alex here, sales manager for Arch Co. with your summer market update for Chepstow, Caldicott and the surrounding areas. So far, this summer has been a bit of a heat wave, but is the property market cooling? After the buying frenzy of the past few months, we're starting to see the first hints of a slowdown in the property market. That said, record prices are still being achieved across the area. So what does this mean for homeowners trying to decide whether to sell or to stay put for now? And what about for you first time buyers? Is this a good time to consider buying your first home? In this market update, I share stats, facts, and opinions to help you make an informed decision. The pandemic caused an unprecedented demand for homes that offer an attractive lifestyle, especially for those leaving the cities for the countryside. Combined with the stamp duty and land transaction tax extensions, low interest rate mortgages, and the return of five and 10% deposits, this tipped the demand supply curve massively in favor of sellers, as supply levels dwindled, yet high demand remained. As an example, in July 2020, there were 554 homes available for sale in MP16 and MP26. Whereas in July 2021, there are only 254 homes available, meaning that there were 53% less properties available to buy compared to the same period last year. This increase in demand also led to an increase in the number of sales being agreed, with 92 sales agreed in July 2021 versus 74 sales being agreed in July 2020, an increase of 24.32%. According to Zoopla, UK house prices have now hit a new record high and are 30% above the peak prior to the crash of 2008. Here's some statistics that you might surprise you. At present, 68% of all properties advertised in MP16 and MP26 are currently under offer, which again suggests we're still very much in the seller's market. In Monmouthshire, the average price for a property currently stands at approximately 302,000, and over the last 12 months, house prices have increased on average by 11.43%, which is slightly below the average Welsh house increase of 13.53%. The average price of a detached home in Monmouthshire currently stands at around 435,000. A semi-detached property currently fetches around 256,000. Terrace properties are going for around 207,000, with apartments selling for an average of 151,000 pounds. The neighboring county of the Forest of Dean has seen a 12.28% increase, which surpasses the English average increase of 9.7%. So what about first time buyers? Well, many first-time buyers are still worried about whether now is a good time to buy. With house prices still rising and many properties still receiving multiple offers, it can be a really tough time for buyers to find and secure a property. So, should they still try to buy now or wait for the market to cool down before taking the leap? If we wind back to 2020, 9 in 10, 90 and 95% mortgages were withdrawn from the market in the wake of the COVID-19 outbreak last spring. Over a year on and things are looking much better for first-time buyers with small deposits. The vast majority of lenders have brought back their 90% mortgages and the 95% mortgage guarantee scheme launched in April has resulted in a flurry of deals coming back to the market with some interest rates available for first-time buyers for as little as 2.3%. So even with house prices at an all-time high, with low deposit mortgages now readily available plus some of the cheapest borrowing rates we've seen in years, now could be a really good time to get on the property ladder. So heading into the second half of 2021, what are our predictions for the property market? Whilst we are noticing a slight slowdown in the market, homes are still in high demand. Over the next few months, it is predicted within the industry that we could expect to see some of the buoyancy of the current market begin to disappear, leaving us with a more stable property market. With COVID restrictions easing, hospitality venues reopening, and the summer holidays in full swing, and people enjoying vacations and staycations, we are experiencing a more traditional summer market. We are expecting to see a bounce in the market going into September and on to October, with home movers eager to move before Christmas. So if you're considering buying or selling a home in the next few months, a chat now might help you make the right decision for you and your family. So please get in touch. We very much look forward to talking to you.